Hi, I'm Deanna Meski here with HRC TV, providing you with historical restoration and construction education throughout the United States. Today we are taking you to meet one of the top slate installers in the country, who is also the Executive Vice President of the Durable Slate Company, Mr. John Chan. He will be teaching you how to install a slate roof. Let's go have a look. Hi, I'm John Chan with Durable Slate, and we're here to show you how to do a new slate roof. We started with this mock roof by installing number 30 saturated felt, and we used these cap nails to hold it down for heavy wind. So at the bottom of a roof, you can put drip edge, usually copper, or slate is actually a natural drip edge. So we're just gonna go ahead and start with wood cant strip. Now that we've got the cant strip installed, we're gonna measure off 10 and a half inches because I'm using 12 inch backers. I'm gonna install a nail so that I don't need somebody to hold the chalk line for me. And right there is my line. I'm going to pull this nail out and we're going to install the first backer. So we went back side up, so I'm going to punch it from the front side. Okay, so what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to want one inch overhang here, so I'm going to mark it with one inch. Again, I'm going to punch it from the front side. Now notice how I nailed these slates so that they're flush. They're not sticking up too high and they're not pinning the slate down. If you pin the slate down too hard, what will happen is that that slate over time with wind will actually cause that nail hole to go right through or break. So we're going to start off with a half piece here, which I've already cut, and we're going to install it right here. I'm just going to go ahead and line this up. I'm tapping the slate to make sure that's good and sound. If I hear a vibration, I know that it's broken. Now you'll see here why I started with a half row. Because this slate goes here, and if I'd have started with a full row, then they would line up. So this one goes right here. Now see, that seam breaks right here, and you don't want them to line up so that the water doesn't get in the house. Now, I'm gonna chalk out the rest of the roof. Because these are 20 inch slates, I'm gonna want eight and a half showing, eight and a half inches. So I'm gonna mark up from here, eight and a half, 17, 
25 and a half. So here's eight and a half, 17, 25 and a half. Same thing here, eight and a half, 17, 25 and a half. And now I can take the chalk line, put it on here, pull it out, and I can chalk this by myself. I'm gonna pull it over to my line, and again, I can chalk it by myself. With a chalk in line, I can either pull these or nail them all the way in. I'm just going to pull these out. Right now, I'm going to show you how this roof works. The very bottom row is this 12 inch piece. So you see, you're going to actually have three and a half inches of triple coverage. You've got this slate that you can't see underneath, this slate, and this slate. And that's what keeps the water out because water can't penetrate this stone. And continue up the roof. All right, so now that we have four rows on, you can see exactly how a slate roof works. When water gets through the slate right here, it spreads out like this. Well, when it gets down here, it gets onto this slate. So it gets onto this slate like this. And then you have this slate back here. So what you have actually is so you have three layers of slate and this what we call the head lap or here from here to here you're gonna have three layers of slate as I said this is millions of years old the stone and that's what's gonna keep your house dry as we're going up the roof what we're gonna do is we're gonna angle our lines so that it goes straight to the top and it looks perfect from the eye because no roof is going to be actually perfect in height from one side to the other. That's the way you do it, the Durable Slate Company. Well, like John Chan says, that's how it's done. And that about wraps up this segment of HRC TV. Stay tuned for more educational videos in the historical restoration and construction world. If you would like to see if your company qualifies to be one of our featured businesses, contact us via the information on this screen. See y'all later.